Hello everyone, I hope you are well. In today's video, we will see how can we generate graphs and charts using Bing AI. But before starting, did you watch my previous video in which I talked about the best courses to learn ChatGPT? If you are new here, I am Asan and I post tutorials on this channel. If you might be interested in watching those videos, consider subscribing to the channel. If you have any questions, comment down in this video. Let's start today's video without any further delay. First of all, open Bing AI. You will get this screen. And what you have to first do is to click on more creative option then you have to just type this prompt which i am typing i want to create a chart for google sheets of most widely used programming languages among developers worldwide as of 2022 show me a table with the data i can copy paste and write the code for a Google Feeds macro to automatically draw the line chart. So in this prompt, I asked about the most widely used programming languages among developers worldwide as of 2022. If you want to search for any other thing, you can definitely go for it. But I'm right now going for most widely used programming languages among developers worldwide as of 2022. So what you have to do just press enter or you have to just click this button let's see what bing generate right now so guys here is the result bing AI generated so these are the languages you can just copy and paste in google sheets i will tell you how you can do it and this is the code for google sheet macro so in order to get the chart you have to first copy this table you have to just copy it and then what you have to do next is to search for google sheets and press enter so you have to go to this link if you haven't signed into this google account you have to first sign in into your account and then you will be able to see this is great what you have to do is to paste it just right here and then what you have to do next is to get the code which bing ai generated so here's the copy button you can just copy it from right here what you have to do next is to first of all select these two columns in which your data exists then you have to click on extensions and then go to apps script after clicking on this screen you will just get this screen and there is a function you have to remove it and then paste that code after pasting this code you have to run this program but you will see that you will you won't be able to run the program so therefore you have to first save it you can just do it by pressing ctrl n s and it will say saving project and then the run button will be enabled press it and let's see what it gives so it might ask you for the permissions then you have to review permissions because it is the untitled project which is going to be connected to your account so you have to select your account and you have to click on advanced and go to untitled project unsafe you have to allow this and then you will see execution is started execution complete you have to go back to that tab where your data exists and you, you then you will be able to see this screen so here is the data that you will get it will make it easy for you to see the chart because it is in the tabular form and then you can actually represent this data in many forms you have to just click on this edit chart button click on it and you will see chart type you have to click on line chart which you will see that it is exactly created right here if you want to create bar charts you have to, you can just select for right from here so this is called column chart or you can say bar chart you can also create pie chart from this you will see many representation of this is the like this right here and you can select any one of them according to your needs so this was all about today's video you have learned how to create charts and graphs using bing ai with the help of google sheets and app script i talked about most widely used programming languages but if you want to analyze more data or if you want to give a specific instructions to bing ai for example if you want to generate data from 2021 to 2022 you can also tell bing ai to do it so if you like the video click the subscribe button and don't forget to click the bell icon so you will be notified when i publish the video thank you guys for watching